Saturday is usually the, the day that I make these vlogs. I know in the previous vlogs I've said that I study mostly at home. I've been studying at home because it I think that it's where I feel the most comfortable. But for the last two weeks of exam studying, um, I've done most of my studying exclusively at school and I've left all my books there so I'm not carrying things back and forth. So here's my study area from home. It's been not really used lately um, i don't really know what i'm going to do about all these things that i have on the wall because i think it's nice to have in front of me when i study so i might bring it over um just for the last week of studying studying is almost done and like i mentioned in the last video it's been very tiring um, mentally and physically but i feel like i've had a pretty good balance in you know studying and you know sleeping well and working out I guess if there's anything that I wish that I had done a little better is maybe um, food wise. Um, if I had prepped the food or done something like that, I think I wouldn't be wondering what I'm going to be eating that day, which I normally like during uh, outside of um, USMLE step studying time, like I always prep my food and I always know what I'm going to be eating. So this was a bit of a departure from that. But anyway, I'm gonna head to school. I thought I might bring you guys with me because it's Saturday, so the school might not be as crowded. So I thought I might maybe vlog there or at least show you guys what it's like to study um, at my school. <laughs> the nice thing about coming to school on a Saturday is you get to park really close to school, which is nice, especially if you're leaving really late at night after midnight. Um, but I, I'm pretty sure that's the only positive about coming to school on a Saturday. But anyway, I'm doing some biostatistics and uh, EBM, evidence-based medicine type of review today. So that's what I'm studying and obviously like an overall review as well. study area at school. I didn't want to disturb anyone but I'm usually the last one here anyway so this is the study area all the cubicles here this is my cubicle here I usually have my computer it's um, packed away now have my pens my books here have some gums Hairbrush, blanket, this is um, zippered but there's a blanket inside, all my books, my headphone, my note cards, hair clip, um, my computer stand, tissues, and earplugs, very important. Here in my food area, it's a lot less than what I showed in my Snapchat, but I still have some cans of tuna here, um, one thing of cup noodles here. Some popcorn, some green tea latte, soy milk thing, <laughs> this thing, and some just bars and some random snacks, some chips in there, chips, hot Cheetos, um, microwavable rice, and I have another blanket here which is really really a scarf but it's really big so so this is my study cubicle somebody asked if we were assigned cubicles but we're not um, but they're mostly free everyone's out for the summer the only people who are here really are um, I think mostly M2 studying for their step um, so I'm gonna be here for one more week and I'm done and I'm really excited to be done I'll talk about what I did during the day 
I was, I was studying for some like biostatistics and some random like EBM, evidence-based medicine stuff, sort of like the leftover topics that I didn't really go over earlier. And then I reviewed some more drugs watching Sketchy Micro. And then I did a couple practice tests. These are shorter 40, um, 40 question blocks on New World that I did. Um, and then sort of just like leftover topics now that my test is so close I'm just doing whatever topic that I feel like I forgot um, so I reviewed a little bit of vasculitis also um, and then I sat down with my friend Dania and we did sort of the um, pro prep process for the exam day so there's a tutorial for the exam um, I guess software that you can kind of preview and go over before the exam and that's really good to do so you're not um, learning the software the day of your exam and I think there's something similar for MCAT as well. Um, and then we talked about the formulas and different things that we want to write down before the exam starts during that um, I guess um, prep time during that um, tutorial time so um, we watched the tutorial we came up with some equations that we want to talk about or that we want to write down in our piece of paper um, on the day of the exam and we'll um, we'll continue to add to um, equations do that list of equations to memorize and write down um, as the week goes along so um, I'm gonna go home now it's like midnight and I'm really tired so I hope you guys enjoy the vlog and um, comment below and see. let me know what you guys want to see now that my, my step setting is almost done. And I have a couple of surprises coming up for you, maybe some giveaways coming up, so stay tuned for that. And like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Hi Candy! You miss me? Hi. What a cute cat. What a cute cat you are.